Hey Slayers, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we're reacting to Agatha All Along episode three. I am in love with this series. I'm having so much fun with you guys. Thanks for the newbies here on the channel. If you are new, make sure to subscribe. I'm posting Agatha All Along every Wednesday. Give this a thumbs up, comment below. We love it. So kind of a lot of information in the first two for me because I wasn't so brushed up on the Marvel lore and stuff like that. But yeah, so thanks to you guys. I feel like you cleared up a few things for me and I'm excited to continue this journey down the witch's road, which is such a bop. I repeat, such a bop. These characters are so fun. It's just so my vibe. Like I love the spookiness with the comedic aspects, but like dark and meaningful still. I just love it. I'm having so much fun. So thanks to you guys. I feel as so I'm pretty up to date with understanding everything that's going on. Pretty sure I know where Teen's character is going. If I'm right, I kind of know. I would assume what he's going to want to do at the end of the road. As I react, I'll probably remember a few things that I'll bring up, so make sure you watch all the way through. If you'd like, though, to watch the uncut reaction, check out my Patreon. Link will be below. I also have memberships. You guys could look at the tiers. I really wanted to get a monthly live stream pop in where we could discuss the show and stuff but I think it'll just be me, it seems like. But yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. Down the witch's road, bitch. Give me that little recap, baby. Oh, <laughs> remembering things already. I was a little confused with Agent Agnes. I was like, aren't the townspeople wondering where is she vibes? You guys let me know that that character, the Agent Agnes, was completely in her head and no one else. That whole thing was just in her head. Also why she sat at like the desk table thinking it was her car because I guess she's just been in the house thinking all of this. That being said, I think the neighbor called her Agnes and he was she was like, it's Agatha. Or like, are they just going along with it? I'm still a little fuzzy, but like, I get it, you know? And to access the road, Lilia. I, I also know sky. that this is the, the world of like where WandaVision was. You, Where's our green witch? Oh, I know who it is. Okay, another thing. Thank you for this previously. I remember they said they needed a black heart or something. The lesbian vibe. I was saying her name wrong, so... But like the agent girl with the black heart that you guys know what I'm talking about. It was kind of clear that it meant her. Hmm. Shout out to Amanda. You commented something and I can't remember exactly what you said. Shit. Because her last name is Hart, like she was just kind of going along with it. Though I guess they just needed an extra person and I guess it didn't really matter that it had to be exact to open it because they went down the road as we know. Down the witch's road Through many miles of tricks and trails I love this atmosphere I pictured it Yes, suits you Does You didn't think it was real, did you? You did? Nor the fact that something just chased us down here Chased Agatha She's got a point Is this like perpetual night? Like, as a vibe? Okay, I <laughs> am a nem Tame your fears that's what we're up against. Our worst nightmare. But in what form? Trials. The road will test us in our knowledge of the craft. But what about Sharon? Without any power. There's always analog magic. You know? Pardon? Witchcraft. Emphasis on the craft. Who are you? <laughs> well, I'll be. Someone's put a sigil on that boy. Looks like Agatha brought a sparkly little mystery with her. I have no idea what's under that sigil. It could uh. be something special. Or it could be a pest. I really am interested in what challenges they're going to have going down this road. Especially because they I don't have power, which was another thing I was, like, thinking about. And you want to find out what happened to Mommy? Power, fortune, Mommy. Wait, where's Mrs. Hart? No. Ugh, I mean, if you take your eyes off of her for two seconds. It's... <laughs> the score in this is beautiful. Rule number one, do not step off the road. Oh, mm. 
eyes straight on from the path. So if we just follow the instructions of the ballad, we'll be safe as kittens. Look. Uh oh. Was that there before? Is that a track? The phases of the moon. It's full of water face. <laughs> this feels like a different show all of a sudden. The road changes <gasps> for the coven. Fun. Loving this. Oh my god. Clean boy and girl aesthetic. These don't open. Oh my god! Bury me in that kitchen! <laughs> Check this out. What is this? A wedding? Please god, not a baby shower. Uh, <laughs> the witch's road cordially invites you to the first trial. Oh my god. Obsessed. So, my age has value. I'm no fun alone. I mess with your mind. My tricks are well known. I mess with your mind. My tricks are well known. Sounds like a witch. Sounds like you. Mm -hmm. Wine! That's it. Ten points for Mrs. Hart. Ten points for what now? Oh, wine. Wait, wait, wait. We don't know what's going to happen. Like if we aged do that. wine. Yeah, sure, we do. Something terrible. But if we don't follow these obvious breadcrumbs, we can't move forward and we won't get to the big prize. So, does anybody have a corkscrew? There's a built in bar. Oh. Watch your back with Agatha. Did you know she traded her own child for the Book of the Damned? Nicholas? That can't be true. You're probably right. But that is what people say. They say no one really knows what happened to him. <sighs> I don't think she did that. They say he might be a demon. Found it. So I guess I've been being coy with what I'm thinking for him, mainly because I don't want anyone to spoil it. I actually think I did say this maybe in like the first episode. I think he might be Scarlet Witch's son, and if he's gonna get to the end of the road, is he gonna try to bring her back? But now that just kind of made me think, what if he's Agatha's son, Nicholas? Which is what I thought he was gonna be when Agatha went in the room, and then he was in the room. So that's kind of cool. At the same time, he's, he just seems to have his whole own life going on, but I guess what is real, what is fake. I can't believe we had that boyfriend call moment and never followed up on that either. I want to know more. Ooh, healthy boar. <sighs> Is teen allowed to drink? Well, he's not even supposed to be here, so he probably doesn't get a cup. Oh, man. <sighs> they have to figure this out wine drunk. Maybe they just all have to finish it. To the prize. <laughs> Here we go. Should we take the girl talk to the sofa? Might as well. Oh. I'm obsessed with this. Really like your tattoo. Where'd you get it? Nowhere. Okay. Interesting. Got it in Colorado. It's also good for her to not be drunk. My mom was playing Red Rocks. That symbol wards off curses, right? She, um... Made me get it. She <laughs> said all the women in our family were cursed. How old were you? Oh, you have to drink it. Thirteen, maybe? I guess. Well, it happened to me at thirteen, too. Hmm. It's your eyeliner. Drink the blood of a virgin if it would smooth out some of these wrinkles. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, you are <gasps> so sweet. Is it bad? I think she looks fantastic. We've been poisoned. What? Oh my god, I have jowls! Ah, my face! I don't hate it. Oh my god. Is that what I look like? Since you were the first to drink, you're our canary in the coal mine. Oh, thanks. Oh, yeah. it's poison Sharon, remember? Why don't you just let her drink it all? Uh, it just serves our best interests, is all. <laughs> her face didn't change. Identify the toxin, okay? Do you feel a tingling in the back of your throat? No. Do you hear any <laughs> ringing or the sound of fairies crying? Huh? Uh -huh. I love you guys. Uh. What? I feel a little better. Your face is back to normal. Oh, thank goodness. Why? The fact that the face swelling decreased so quickly means it could be only one type of poison. Alewife's revenge. Face swelling is just the beginning. Next is dizziness, delirium, loss of motor function. My heart's racing. That's another one. Also hallucinations. And eventually... Death. I had a feeling she was going to say that. I've got to get out of here. <laughs> you can't run from the poison. She didn't drink the poison. You can't cheat, Agatha. Who says? The road. I'm going <laughs> to shove it down your gun so oh. me. You know what? <gasps> no! <Yeah. laughs> She's ready for you. Drink. Now. Fine. 
then I will. No. no. Interesting that she would care. It's for herself, I feel, not for his well-being. Maybe she needs him for something. Oh, so cheap. Please, <laughs> Wanda. Can you guys Wanda, sit down? I'm you. Let him breathe. <gasps> it's time to brew an antidote. I need frankincense and the gut of a used social insect. We'll handle that first part. I need a corpse that's been decaying for at least 30 million years. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Why do I have to translate? It's, it's in petroleum products. Oh, maybe you can do this. Go, on the way. <laughs> now I just need a really big cauldron that could work. <laughs> a nice farm sink. Petroleum. Uh, like Vaseline. Uh, jelly. Uh, jelly. Uh, of course, Jen's skincare made it to the road. I mean, there's no petroleum in there. No, a snake oil salesman when I see one. Call her bluff. <laughs> Try to send Agatha. <laughs> yes, I love this plan. I, I just think we should find the ingredients first, though, right? I don't even know what they're looking for, like what that so meant. Just Oils. Is she gonna hallucinate? Dizzy. A mix of everything. It's giving hallucination. Oh, he just went in there, but now she can't open the door. Oh. I have newt. I have newt. A classic. Also known as mustard seed. Okay, so everyone's going through a hallucination. I'm interested if there's like a connection or it's all randomness. The mom, maybe? Mom? An inconvenient woman. I think she knows who it is. I feel like they know probably the person. But she's like from, oh wait, she's old. She's like 400. Interesting. Died today, thousands of miles away, and I could still feel it when it happened. It's my turn now. It's gonna kill me. Don't say that. What's Agatha doing right now? <sighs> How fucking scary. No, you're nothing. So scary. Is this underwater? Are we underwater right now? Starting with gut and eye. It's cool because this is witchcraft where they're used to going like that. All natural or not, Jen. Drop it in. I knew it. See now? Obviously. I didn't even realize that meant her. So pretty. Any bright ideas on how to set this sink to boil? Is there a sous vide? Oh, brilliant. Is that something people know about? It's a super fancy cooking tool. My dad loves his. Oh, cute. Counterclockwise. To the left. Great. Everyone, pull a strand of hair out of your head now. <sighs> oh, this is her hallucination. Sweet Nicholas. Okay, I don't feel teen is Nicholas. Oh, the buh. Agatha! What did you see? She'll never tell you. Nothing. We need your hair. Now, stop stirring. We need to clasp hands, clear your minds. Once our intentions are aligned, it'll glow bright cerulean. I get cerulean and chartreuse confused. Is cerulean the green one? No, it's blue. Then it's not working. We're all gonna die here! What are we gonna do? I have always hated you, but I left you alone. Because what you were doing was important. Not this kale care crap. Real work. You can be that witch again. They can take I your have chills. power, Jen. But they can't take your knowledge. Jen. Blood. Mm. Who's in how much? We need the blood of the unpoisoned. The boy. Thanks for being underage. I guess so. Oh! There we go. It's purple. Okay, hold the hands and clear the mind. No. The timer's still ticking. This is hard. 
Oh my god. Oh. Oh. oh my god. Did it work? Oh, we gotta go in there. This is so cool. This is so good. I am not climbing in an oven. Oh, we're going. This is so good. <laughs> Ooh, is it like a slide? Maybe shut it? Okay. Obsessed. Is heart okay? We're alive. We made it through the first half. Everyone is safe. Not Except everyone. Sharon's dead. <sighs> because she shouldn't have been here. Oh no. Who's Sharon? Off with your head. Dance till you're dead. Heads will roll. I have chills. This is so fucking good. R.I.P. Shannon. I gotta cross out her name. Oh, hopefully, since this is some weird alternate universe, she'll become alive again in the end. Or in the real world, she's alive still. I wonder if she died because she was like the first one to drink. Or if she got affected because she's not really a witch. I'm kind of thinking it's because she was the first to drink. But like, that's also not fair. Hmm. This is so cool. The idea of witchcraft and like kind of having to, to get them back to the root of magic where Jen said could just swish her hand and do it kind of thing. That's just such an interesting concept. I'm writing a book and I have a witch in it and she's sober, a sober witch. I would kind of like to incorporate that in my own way when eventually she has to go back to magic. But whatever, I'm obsessed with this. This is so beyond creative. I have no predictions really. I feel like this is just gonna continue to blow my mind. So thank you guys for watching this video. I will see you guys next Wednesday. Please, if you're new, again, subscribe, comment below, give this a thumbs up, and I'll see you bitches later. It's Billy Witch.